Yes, yes, yes. It is shampoo day, y'all. It is shampoo day and it is deep conditioning day. It's time for me to spoil her. Spoil her. Remember, I did a wash and go. And then I flipped the wash and go and did a twist out. And now we just want to take this down. Because I was going to wear it another day until I realized it's time to shampoo and deep condition my hair. And I'm going to tell you guys the products I'm going to be using. Earth Supply. I tried them one time. I can't remember the outcome of it. I can't remember the outcome of it. But I have my... Oh, look. I still got... Mm, still got the definition and shine in there. But what I think helped it was this edge booster so I got this on deck to put up my twist with we're going in with earth supplied shampoo okay textured hair sulfate free enriched with shea butter no silicones no sulfates parabens or mineral oil that's what we're going in with to shampoo our hair and then they have a leave-in conditioner uh 20 percent shea butter is in this as well and this is the leave-in conditioner okay i'm going to go in with palmer's coconut oil deep conditioning protein pack for dry and damaged hair now these are little packets that i picked up because actually that's all that i saw and i see i got two of them i don't know if it's going to take two to do my hair or not but this is a um, sustainable source of coconut oil and Tahitian manure. It has coconut oil, manure oil, keratin protein, silk protein, and coconut milk. So the, the silk protein restores high gloss, high gloss shine. The keratin protein strengthens and repairs. So, we're going to go in with this for our deep conditioner. I'm going to put my deep conditioner cap on my head and sit under my dryer for like 15 minutes to make sure this gets in good. I'm about to go jump in the shower. Give my hair about all the time that it needs to soak up and, you know, saturate my hair, which my husband... He's really on me about this water bill, y'all. I'm going to have to start doing my hair when he out the house. Anyway, um, I will be right back. Am I missing anything? Okay. The cream, creamy defining gel oil. So, these two things here, the gel oil and the curl activator, I'll be putting in with the edge booster. I found another edge booster I had, and I see why I got a new one now. But I had a little more left in here, and I could have used that. So I'm going to go ahead and finish this off. I'm going to finish that one off. And we're going to put up some protective hair twists. Because protective hair is what makes my hair grow. And then when I take it out, I have a bomb twist out. If it ain't broke. Don't fix it. Just relax and let it flow. You see what I'm saying? All right. Well, I'll be right back. Okay. Shampoo was what that was. Shampoo was what that was. Okay. I have fully, I waited to rinse out my deep conditioner after I took my shower. I sit under the dryer for a little bit. Then I took my shower. Then I rinsed out my deep conditioner. And my hair felt good so far. But now I'm about to put in the leave-in conditioner, and we're going to see how my hair feels now that it's had a little time to get a little water off of it. And we'll see how it goes. I'm trying to turn my phone on silent. Yeah. Hair is moisturized, and it feels so good it feels so good okay protein protein is in the hair Ooh, now the leave-in conditioner is thick it is thick oh 
Hold on. Definitely not going to be able to just put that over my head. Gonna have to put my hair in sections. That's just too thick. I'm right now. Okay. So while I'm working on the front, the back will be marinating in that thick stuff. It say 15% shea butter, and shea butter is a thick thing when it's raw. If it's raw, it's thick. Let's see if I can squeeze. Yeah. See, I turned it upside down like this. Ranting, ranting. Okay, let's see. And I always take a piece apart up at the top. I'm trying not to make big gaps because I want that definition that I had before. me because they're right in my face but I think I'm going to sit under the dryer opposed to air drying
is go sit under the dryer instead of um, doing twist in the back because I always do twist in the back I want to do something different so I did a bun in the back and just have my hair going up in a bun so I'm gonna go sit under the dryer for a minute or two or first see if I got any errands to run let it air dry a little bit then sit under the dryer and we're going to see how this going to turn out. This little updo and do up and up and doing and doing and stuff. Got that all on my face. Yeah, I got stuff all everywhere. I got to clean up my studio. Got to clean up my studio. Hot mess. Hot mess. But I'll be right back with y'all. Okay, so I decided to let my hair air dry. I got under the dryer. I sit under there for like 10, 15 minutes. And then I found something an errand I had to run so I let my hair air dry I have the twist coming down in the front and I have a little ball I forgot what to call them puff little puff ball in the back and so now I'm just going to spray my hand with my oil My hair is dry. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. This is making sure this ain't that that Shea Moisture oil. Oh, I don't even like to think about it. I don't even like to think about it, child. So I'm going to go in and untwist these. I just decided to do something different with the with the updo. I wanted an updo. So I was like, you know what? While I was cleaning up my thing, I was like, I got one of those little donut holes. I can work off the donut hole. And then I came up with all these ideas and then I was like, well no, just right now. Do what you was doing. Do what you was doing. So I am taking down the twist. Let me speed this up. You've seen this before. twist in the front a bun in the back my hair is complete my hair is clean I like to thank earth supplied their shampoo their very thick well I would like to thank urban supplied earth supplied shampoo and then I went in with the protein pack from Palmer's and then after that, that's when I applied the leave-in conditioner and the curl popping activator, which is thick out of this world, thick out of this world, but it, it comes out creamy. It comes out really creamy, so I like that. And then I found also that I have some Earth Supplied Shine and Hold Mist, so I can spray with that and refresh with that. So that's it. That concludes this video. If you're new to my channel, go ahead and subscribe. Click on the notification bell. 
so you'll be alerted every time I put up a new video. And keep God first in everything you do, and I do mean everything, and you will always be on top. Always. When you're at the bottom, when you feel like you're at the bottom, the lowest that you can't get no more, you're always on top. Because who can come against you when God is before you? What can stand against you when God is before you? Nothing. So keep God first in everything you do. And I'll see you guys in the next video.